Stop and think about it, folks. We have racers here from the West Coast, from the East Coast, from Canada, Texas, New Mexico. Great race weekend to see so many competitors make their way from across the country to compete as part of our Lucas Oil Drag Racing Series Tour. The Lucas Oil Drag Racing Series Tour consists of 42 races across the country, divided into seven different divisions, each division holding six events. And this is now the final race of the year here in Division 5, the north central part of the country. Missouri, Kansas, Colorado, and points north. Racers from all across the country, though, can roll in and earn points in division and out of division points. Looking for divisional championships, looking for national championships. Interesting to sit here in the tower and look out at the grandstands. You watch the folks watching the cars going down the racetrack, and then the next thing you know, they're next craning and looking at the sky overhead. Quite the weekend. Kind of like being in Vegas, where the Jets out in Ellis always give us a little bit of an air show. Here this weekend, though, we got something Ellis Air Force Base never has had, at least since I've been going out to Vegas, and that's B-29s and P-51s. Here we go, final pair. Alcohol drags. <laughs> Drivers have to have a good understanding of weather, science, math, to be able to figure out what these cars are going to be able to run. If you want to be a race car driver when you grow up, you better study hard in the math class, the science class, because you have to be able to use all of that knowledge to figure out what the cars are going to run. And today, the weather becomes even more important because you've got a pretty good tailwind and that's going to help push the cars going down the racetrack, making them a little bit quicker. You can see lots of stuff going on here at Great Bend. The air show right over there. Those magnificent B-29s flying around and all sorts of great things to keep an eye on over overhead as we are sending them down the track. You'll want to check it out. I understand motocross going on as well to our north, so... A triple header of action here at this historic facility. Pretty active weekend here in Great Bend, Kansas. Those of you listening in on D3TV, just here on the same property, we also have some motocross competition going on for our friends on two wheels. So between the birds, the cars, and the bikes, Great Bend has been having a great weekend. Everybody make racing possible. Here at SRT Drag Strip, the city of Great Bend, Kansas itself. Central Power Systems and Services. Of course, everybody from the Napa stores in Great Bend. When it settles back down, it rattles the tires. And look at Megan Meyer. 527, 278 miles an hour. They loaded that one up for a bear. They were going after Christine with tooth and claw.